Bowler glass technician Frank Wutzika, better known as Big Frank, will show how to cut a round glass plate from a sheet of 19mm glass and achieve clean cut edges. Many times, unsuitable glass cutters with a wrong cutting angle are used. This automatically leads to an uncontrolled breaking of the glass. The thick glass cutting kit consists of Zilberschnitt thick glass circle cutter, Zilberschnitt cut opening tapper for thick glass, Zilberschnitt system 2000 power oil glass cutter 158 degrees with T-handle, Zilberschnitt cutting fluid for thick glass with dispenser for cutting fluid, and Zilberschnitt cut running pliers. It is very important that the area where the cut will be made is clean because even the smallest dust particles can interrupt the cut. This will inevitably lead to an uncontrolled break. Place the glass on a clean, stable and even felt surface so that it is not subject to any tension. Mark the center of a square glass plate with a cross. Place the suction cup at the center of the desired circle. The suction cup has marks for easier positioning. A heavy duty model of the circle cutter is required to be able to apply the required cutting pressure. The rotating cutting wheel with a cutting angle of 158 degrees, P7, is especially suitable for cutting 12 to 19 millimeter thick glass. Set the wheel holder on the scaled rod to the desired measurement. Circular cuts from 20 to 120 centimeters diameter can be made. Glass always breaks on the path of least resistance. So make sure that the distance between the scoring line and the outer edge of the glass is greater than 10% of the circle diameter. Now trace the complete circle without applying any cutting pressure. This will tell you whether your position is correct to carry out a complete cut in one continuous trace. The special cutting fluid is applied with a dispenser in front of the cutting head. Apply plenty of thick glass cutting fluid to the intended score line. For the wide score, it is necessary to apply more cutting fluid than you would use when cutting thinner glass. The evaporation speed and the viscosity of the fluid play an important role in achieving a good result. The circular cut is normally made in a clockwise direction and started at approximately 20 minutes to the full hour. At this position, the mass ratio of the glass is optimal for the beginning and the end of the cut, cut with a pressure of approximately 10 to 15 kilograms. For a controlled opening of the cut, use the glass tapper. The integrated rubber ring protects the glass surface. The intensity of the glass tapper is adjustable from minimum to maximum. Before you start, select the minimum tapping force. Place the glass tapper underneath the glass directly below the score line. Make sure the head of the tapper is flat against the glass underside. Press the tool firmly against the glass. Release the bolt and open the first section of the cut. If the cut does not open, increase the cutting force a little. Reduce the tapping force after opening the first section of the cut. After that, you open the cut in short distances in a counterclockwise direction. Open the whole circle at the lowest tapping force possible in the opposite direction to that in which the cut was made. The aim is to open the cut in a controlled manner in distances of one inch to a maximum of three inches. The impact force is increased by two to three steps and the cut opener is repeatedly used in all four corners.
When you have reached the starting point again, repeat the process with the higher tapping force setting from the upper side of the sheet. This way, the cut will be opened completely. All cutouts must always be opened from both sides, from above and below, in order to achieve a clean and perfect break. Uncontrolled breaks may occur if the tapping force is set too high initially. Now make four auxiliary cuts. The cuts are made with the glass cutter and the freely rotating cutting head and a blunt cutting angle of 158 degrees. After that, the cuts can also be opened with the glass tapper with half the tapping force and in a central position. The segments are best removed by two persons who evenly press the corner sections onto the cutting table. The segments can then be easily removed. The result is a neat breaking edge which can only be obtained by this method of a controlled opening of the cut. 19mm glass with a perfect cut edge.